Welcome back friends, welcome to another video tutorial from Shomu's Biology and in this video we are going to talk about another very important short tricks to understand plant kingdom. So if you want to understand plant kingdom short tricks or plant kingdom tricks to remember your whole plant kingdom chapter then this video is just for you. So let's begin with the very first thing about the plant kingdom classification and that that will be algae classification here okay so algae classification if you recall your ncrt book there are this table 3.1 and this table the classes listed chlorophyce rhodophyce and pheophyce uh, one of them is green chlorophyce green rhodophyce red and pheophyce brown but the question is how can you remember this information for long period of time so let's talk about that with this trick that I'm going to share with you, you not only remember the name of the class and the and 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 their color, but also you remember the type of food that they store inside their cells. So that's kind of really important. Along with that, I must tell you one more thing about the green algae. Chlorophyll A and B gives the green color. Chlorophyll D adds the red color, and C gives you a brown appearance. Okay, so you should remember that. So green algae has A and B. Red has D along with A is it must be present for photosynthesis along with A D is present for red coloration and for brown algae C is present along with A for uh, the brown coloration that's all but now let's talk about the short trick to remember plant kingdom algae classification and that gives you one important sentence and that sentence is Sushma grab chloroform Sushma grab chloroform okay chloroform is the normal term but we we change that to chloroform okay but it's homophonic so it will work Sushma grab chloroform okay think about chloroform and think about people getting fainted with the chloroform okay so chloroform is a second uh, term but first Sushma grab that one okay so chloroform start with Chloroform means chlorophyce, okay, chlorophyce, that goes uh, chlo for chlorophyce, RHO for, for rhodophyce and PHA for pheophyce, think about that, Chloro, chlorophyce, rho, rhodophyce and form, PHA, pheophyce, so this class names are done with chloroform, now Shushma grab, what they suggest, grab, G-R-A-B, G for green, R for red and B for brown, so G corresponds with the first one, chlorophyce, red R corresponds with the second one, rhodophyce and brown corresponds to the third one, pheophyce. Okay, so we already know about chlorophyce, rhodophyce, pheophyce with green algae, red algae, and brown algae. Now, the last thing is the stored food. That's why Shushma, okay, S U S M A. So, S S M A, this is important. S for starch, the second is also for starch, but this is known as Floridian starch and M A is for manitol okay so first one is again starch second one fluoridine starch and the third one is manitol so you not only know about the, their classes but you know about their color their major pigments and their stored food so till this part can be very well understand uh, understood from this one single simple sentence with chloroform sushma grab chloroform so think about chloroform and sushma you can answer this question so that's how easy it is to understand plant kingdom with the help of short tricks okay algae classification with the help of short tricks now let's look into the second type plant classification so again in plant classification what we are going to talk about here we are going to talk about all brothers please go to angel falls this is the sentence that we remember why starts with all a with give us algae then br br for bryophyte then p for pteridophyte starts with pteridophyte starts with p remember then go g for gymnosperm and to an is for angiosperm two is not important so algae, bryophyte, pteridophyte, gymnosperm and angiosperm. This is how they are arranged. So this is how we can easily find out that uh, like classification of plant kingdom starting from algae, then bryophyte, then pteridophyte, then gymnosperm, then angiosperm. Remember uh, w this sequence is very very important because we are talking about classification. So algae come earlier, angiosperm came at the last. Okay. So it's very important to always look into this sequence and remember the sequences. Okay. So that's why remember the sentence. All brothers, please go to Angel Falls. Remember this. See this Angel Falls. This is a beautiful natural place to see the falls so think about this angel fall you know about the plant kingdom classification quite easily right the other thing is limb if you remember limb then you get uh, l bryophyte b starts with the bryophyte uh, the example of the bryophyte actually so b is a bryophyte so bryophyte example goes with liverworts 
then goes with moss m so these are the example bryophytes example is liverworts and moss so along with this uh, the algae, bryophyte, teridophyte, gymnosperm and angiosperm. We also think about the uh, examples of a bryophyte only and the example can be easily understood with this term limb, L-I-M-B. We all know about the limb. The limb is attached to our body. So limb, B for bryophyte. So example of bryophyte will be L-I for liverworts and M for the moss. Okay, so that's all it is. So if you like this video, please hit the like button, share this video with your friends. If you don't like the video, please hit the dislike button, but still share with your friends some others may like it uh, if you have more suggestion to make these videos please uh, put that in the comment section so that we can read that and make more of this kind of video for you thank you everyone bye